Hello my friends and uh, welcome back to another video. Of course, uh, the content that we are going to be looking at today is, uh, I just want to put a disclaimer out there. What you're about to see is some of the most disgusting, horrific, absolute, terrorizing levels in Mario Maker 2's history. And those terrifying levels come from this creator right here. You might be thinking, what in the world? This is one of the cutest creators I've ever seen. Usabel. Uh, just you wait and see. Usabel has taken the bean burrito formula and cranked it up to 11. Join me on this journey as I show you the horrific abominations Usabel has been creating. Let me first start with Usabel's very first level uploaded in Mario Maker 2. Super Mario Land. You'll notice 17 second world record. It's got a 56 percent clear rate. Let's just take a look, shall we? And oh. <laughs> oh, baby. Now I know what you're thinking, Dave. What? I'm not seeing anything. How is this a horrific abomination monstrosity levels that you were so passionately telling us about in the the intro of this video? <laughs> oh, just you. <laughs> oh, just you wait. Uh so yeah, we're doing we're doing this a pretty nice recreation of the, the first level in Super Mario Land on the Game Boy. Um, yeah, that, yeah that, was, that was great. That was great. Now, shall we get on with the, the real reason you are here? Isabelle's first level was uploaded the day after Mario Maker 2 released, and it took, it took a while to reach the point that I'm about to show you. In fact, it wasn't for a full year later. Isabelle's first abomination came to fruition. It's called Bean Burrito for the Two Towers. Starting with the Two Towers. So this Bean Burrito, mmm, we get to play. Hold on, you can't see. Let me let me move my webcam here. You know it's great. You get to play as uh, you get to play as Mario. Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. Mm so far, so good. Oh, there, yep, there we go. Oh, yep. Yeah. Look at us go, gang. Look at us go. <laughs> oh, man. And as you'll notice, this is just a door. So my guess is that you go through that door there's even more of these jumps. So here's what you need to keep in mind, gang. The fact that, oh, wait a second. I'm getting in a better rhythm now. We're done. We're done here. We're done here. I'm gonna start over. That way I can I can leave Usabel with the like of respect. The fact that Usabel designed this level, clear checked this level, practiced this level, and cleared this level. We have Bean Burrito 6 up next. The Rise of Skywalker. Shall we take a look at this one now? And here we go. Not only are Usabel's fully Bean Burritos, Usabel's levels include very difficult tech. Oh, I bet you I know what you gotta do. Yeah, that's exactly what you gotta do. That's exactly... Exactly what you gotta do. So, Usabel, you know, the Bean Burrito levels that I've played, a lot of them are really tedious, but they're, they're kind of, uh... Kind of, like, on the easier side. It's just, what makes them difficult is the fact that you have to do it so much. Uh, do so many of the same things that it's easy to just mess it up, but these are like super bean burrito levels I'm, I'm gonna give this one a couple more tries We still have a lot more levels to showcase friends Nope, I made it one more dude Alright, so you're... 
apparently Usabel only likes even numbers because next up we have Bean Burrito 8. Now this one I have famously played and failed miserably, but I think it's worth taking the time to show it again. Now this level, it's 3D World and it, it got to showcase this. This level here, almost single-handedly, gave me carpal tunnel for this. This level, single heckin' handedly, nope, <laughs> I can already, I can already feel my thumb. Oh my gosh, we actually weren't even close. We were probably like halfway there. But yeah, this is Bean Burrito 8, Bite the Bullet. Now you gotta remember, gang, yes, these levels are devious. Yes, they are abominations and monstrosity. But you know the skill Usabel has to have to, again, design these levels, play test them, and then ultimately clear them. Oh my gosh, no, I just wanted to get to the top, but again, I can already feel my thumb starting to cramp up, and uh, I'd rather not need carpal tunnel surgery. So let's move on to the next one. Then comes Bean Burrito X or 10, Lost in Space. In space, no one can hear you scream, no matter how frustrated you are. This one is cleared. I'm actually genuinely curious what this one is. I like how every single one of Usabelle's at least says good luck. Oh, no. oh my goodness. <laughs> How are you supposed to do this? Well, let's, I just wanna see if I can get anywhere near. Okay, that was a little bit better. <laughs> I can't even make it past the first jump, man. This one thankfully has been cleared, but a lot of these bean burritos have not been cleared yet. So if you're feeling spicy, if you're feeling If you're feeling up to a, a challenge, an all day challenge, try and clear some of Usabelle's Bean Burritos. See, after Bean Burrito X, then Usabelle started going by increments of one. We got Bean Burrito 11, the Martian. Usabelle put in them. Good luck, thank you. It's always so kind of you. Oh. Uh, Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Flashbacks to Carl's level. So this one is utilizing the wall jump. Um, getting You can get as much infinite height with a wall jump ground pound cancel spin, which I'm not getting. Yo, friends. Friends, we made it to a door. Oh, and they get harder. They get much harder. <laughs> oh my, so that was like the... I was like, yeah, this is a doable bean burrito course. And then I went through the door. <laughs> now we got bean burrito 12. I choose you. Oh, this one has a clear condition. I think this is the first um, that I've seen there is a clear condition. 151 one ups representing Pokemon. Why is it? What the butt? Why is that? Is that all luck? I feel like I just have to run back and forth and hope I get lucky. What? 
Dude, these levels. I know, like, a, a lot of people out there are like, these are just... How? And that's my thought, too. But I'm also legitimately... Amazed. I gotta get all in the first row, right? I just... Just for posterity's sake. I gotta get all in the first row. Got him. Got him. I was actually gonna legitimately try and see how many I could get. <laughs> but... You know what? I'm good. I'm good. We... <laughs> We have more to take a look at. Now, we have Bean Burrito 13, Fast and Furious. Let's see, let's see if we're right here. Again, I, I, I mean, I keep saying this, but I am, I'm more impressed with Usabel being able to, first of all, come up with these monstrosities, but to be able to clear all these levels is, it's really impressive, whether you think it is or not, it's impressive. My friends, this is one that's uncleared, so if you're watching this thinking, I think I could beat this one. Give it a whirl, get that first clear. Let's take a look at Bean Burrito 14 up and down. This one is cleared. It's got a beautiful eight minute world record. Beautiful good luck at the start. Always makes you feel good. <laughs> so you need... <laughs> So you need to uh, stay safely between the purple goop. Oh my gosh! How close were we? We we had to be pretty close. More than anything else, I just want to see what's through the door down here. Is it more of the same? <sighs> Let's look at Bean Burrito 15, 160 feet under. <laughs> Don't do it. Don't even think about it. Not even if you loathe yourself. All right. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. That, that's uh, unbelievable. What, let's give it one more try. Let's see if we can get, uh, let's see if we can get five. <laughs> let's see if we can get five, friends. Got six? Three. <laughs> Three. Got six. One, what is that? One twentieth of the way? <laughs> Oh, now this one's going to be a good one. Bean Burrito 16. The Rack. All right, we, have, we have like three or four more left after this one, gang. S stay with me, please. Stay with me. I'm, I'm losing my mind a little bit. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yo, this one doesn't seem... <laughs> oh, stay with me, friends. We're in this together. <laughs> We're in this together. Let's take a look at the last couple, shall we? Now we have Bean Burrito 17 Taco Doomsday. This is one that does have a clear, so sadly, if this one looks super fun and interesting to you, you can't have the first three. You can get the world record. Oh, no. 
but she can't have that first clear. Okay. This one, honestly... I say honestly feels doable, but I think I've I think I have felt like that on every single one of Usabel's Bean Burrito levels. Like every single one, you start out like, oh yeah, I could uh, maybe do this. There's been a couple where I've been like, yeah, there's literally zero chance that uh, me clearing this is happening. But uh. <laughs> Sidekicks. Now this one, zero clears, friends. Zero. You at sitting at home, having a copy of Mario Maker 2 could be the first clear on this one. Hmm. Maybe will be the first clear. Yeah, this seems not bad. Yo. How does this one have no clears? These levels are like the most legal form of punishment that you could bestow on people. So you you want to <laughs> you want to send your kids to reform school? You have them play <laughs> some Usa <gasps> Bell's levels. We're at the last two. Bean Burrito 19, Fallen Kingdom. <laughs> And here we go. Good luck. Thank you. This one's incorporating Yoshi. Our trusty steed Yoshi finally gets some bean burrito spotlight. All right, there we go. We made it through one section. <laughs> oh, how quickly the turntables. Okay, I dived. I've seen enough. Do you enough? Let's take a look. We got one more. Finally, friends, Usabelle's newest entry into the Bean Burrito franchise, Bean Burrito XX or 20, Lollipop Buzzsaw. I, um, uh, you know, this ride has been, it's been an incredible ride from start to finish. What is this now? What? So I'm just supposed to... Do that? Every single jump, I feel my glutes tightening up. Yeah, we made it through one. Now we get to go back. <laughs> All right, let's just take a look. Let's see how many there are. Let's look at the more info. There's a hundred. You have to do this 200 times. And then I can't even tell. Can anyone tell what is going on at that ending? There's something. Are those skewers? Are those skewers? So you have to do 10 hundred. 10 hundred. So you have to do 200 uh, of those buzzsaw jumps. And then I don't even know what the ending is. <laughs> Well, my friends, I hope you have been as enlightened as I have been as we've taken a look at Usabelle's plethora of bean burrito level offerings. Usabelle is insane, is maniacal, but above all else, Usabelle is talented, has a lot of tenacity, and I truly think 
Usabel is underappreciated. Like, yes, I totally get it that 99.9% .9 of the population out there is going to find these levels horrendous. And they are, they are but they're made to be horrendous. Bean burrito levels are made that way on purpose to make you question your life decisions. And Usabel is proven to be the best in the business at making them. I may never beat any of these levels, but I am truly excited to see what monstrosity Usabel releases next. Tell me what your favorite bean burrito of the bunch was in the comments below. Feel free to check out these levels on your own. Usabel's uh, creator ideas are right above me. It will also be in the description of the video. But that's going to be it for me today, my friends. I hope you have a great rest of your day. And until next time, bye-bye. <laughs>